Now let's add a background. Pick from any of these down here. You could add a tree. Or maybe a bush. Or some grass underneath. Or maybe a partial background. Or maybe you just want to add a photograph. I can drag one of the corner handles down so the monument doesn't look too big on your background. You can also add your own digital photographs by simply clicking File and Import, and import it from your digital camera or a CD or what have you. Now let's add a little bit of contract information so that your customer can sign off on the drawing and date it. Now simply delete everything you don't want and save your work. You can also print your work. You can also export it as a JPEG or other format if you'd like to email it. If you've purchased Monument Designer Extra, you have many more carvings available. If you go to File, Import, and then locate the Monument Designer Extra on the CD, or if you've placed it on your hard drive, you'll find it in a folder. Either way, when you find it, click on the Carvings, Markers, and Panels, and you'll see examples of some of the things that you have available to you. Clicking on a file gives you a preview and a preview screen. This 5000 series is what's commonly known as DMARC Disk 3, or now it's called Classic Components. These are available in CAD files and may be cut in pre-cut stencil and sandblasting. Clicking a file, getting a preview, and then clicking Import will bring a marker onto the screen. Just click it and your carving will be placed on the monument. Click and drag to make it smaller. If your monument's grouped together, click Arrange, Ungroup, clear your selection by clicking in some white space, click the thing you'd like to delete. In this case, the monument needs to be ungrouped again since it was made of several groups. Now we can click and delete the praying hands and move the dove into position. Monument Designer works with bitmaps. This is nice for presentations and gives you a shape carved look with lots of color, but there are no lines that will cut. That's what classic components or disk 3 can be used for. Simply reference the number of the dove. This was 5022. All the other carvings also have numbers and may be cut in pre-cut stencil using the vector or CAD files. 
There are also many monument shapes available too. Lots of contemporary shapes in five colors, blue-gray, pink, red, black, and mahogany, in addition to all of the carvings that are available in the Design Mart Monument Designer Extra Set. All these blank shapes, as well as all the carvings, are available in DMARC Disc 3 or Classic Components. Well, you've successfully completed your first monument with Design Mart's Monument Designer. We hope you'll enjoy using Monument Designer, and we hope you'll enjoy using the extra components that are available as well. We also hope that you'll find it easy to order pre-cut stencil and monuments from your manufacturer using the 5000 series numbers. Please feel free to email Design Mart or call if you have any questions at any time.